love the first walkthrough of a crime scene. It's kind of like arriving at summer camp, except the lake is full of blood and your bunkmate is dead. I think I might be bad at metaphors. So after Adams comes home from work, the only person who even approaches his doorway is this delivery guy? Yeah, but he never enters the apartment. Hey, Rosa, check it out. Triple digis. There's so much evidence, we hit triple digis. Cool. Cool indeed. But you know what's not cool? Our Vic ordered his dinner from House of Lettuce. There's no way this guy knew he was gonna die. No one would want lettuce as their last meal. For example, my last meal is guns to be sour straws. You just keep those in your pocket? We face death every day. I gotta be prepared to go out on my own terms. I can't even think about eating. It smells like the brim of Scully's hat in here. That's the heat wave. It sped up body decomp. Guess you could say this mystery is straight out of decomp. 10. Now. Who are you? I'm Franco McCoy. I'm running CSI and forensics. You two must be detectives, I can tell, because you look pretty buttoned up. We're both wearing leather jackets. And I won this hoodie for eating a big pizza. Just do me a favor. Don't turn into a star hump around me or my squad because they make TV shows about us sometimes. What? They make shows about us all the time. <clears throat> Name one. Law and Order. Never heard of it. NYPD Blue. No. Nope. Miami Vice. No. Nah. Hill Street Blues. Pass. The Wire. Sounds dumb. Rizzoli and Isles. Okay, that's a good one. All right, if the heat is causing the smell, why don't we just turn on the air conditioning? Whoa, 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 whoa. That kind of airflow is going to kick up all kinds of dust particles. That AC stays off, which means the odor in here, only gonna get worse. Pro tip, plug your noses. Had this little bad boy custom made 3D printed to fit these sweet nostrils. Are you trying to abbreviate nostrils? In CSI, we don't try. We do, Sud. Okay, well it's been sort of okay meeting you. We're gonna turn our backs and ignore you now. Hey Jake, you know what it's time for? I sure do. Jake, Jake and Rose's, Rose's first impressions. impressions. Cast off pattern on the far wall suggests upward knife slices, Jake. Wounds on the Vic's back means he didn't see the killer coming. Rosa? Laptop, wallet, keys, all in plain sight. No sign of forced entry, doesn't connote a robbery, Jake. But it does connote that our killer was waiting for Adams in the apartment. Did I just use the word connote correctly? You did. Great, will you text that to Amy? I don't want to say what using a vocabulary gets me. Okay. Sexual intercourse. Oh, gross. What? We're adults. I'm his mother, let me in. <sighs> Rock, paper, scissors for who has to talk to the Vic's mom. Deal. It's a game of chance. How do you always win? You always pick paper. That is not true. Here, go again. One more time. All right, one more time. One more time. One more time. One more time. All right, one more time. One more time. God, this reverse psychology is a bust! 